So apparently, the amp has something loose inside. So I've got to take it before I try to test it. I've got to take the bottom off and see what's inside that's loose. It's a sprue. See that? All right, I'm going to video the blow here like Rob did just to see if we're getting that same weird voltage um, oscillation that he was getting. So we got it uncertified at one ohm. Let's watch the voltage here. So I didn't see it oscillating like he did, but we got some weird stuff here with the dyno. This 54 uncertified and 11 right there. That's it's some kind of a error code the dyno is putting out. Ball pump 4K, let's try. Certified at 0.8, 40 hertz. I don't think it's gonna run well since it didn't do the one ohm run cleanly, but let's try it. It did that weird thing with the dyno again. All right, we dropped it down to 0.8. Let's try uncertified at 0.8. Something is going on here with the uh, with the dyno. I don't know what's up with that. Tony D, if you're watching, can you tell me what the heck this means? Because I do not know. I've seen it do it before, but only when an amp actually reached its reached the limit of the dyno. And I know we're nowhere near that here. It must be some really dirty output. Let's try 0.8 uh, dynamic. It's still doing some funky things. Throwing up some numbers over here. We got a 15 here. We got a 47 Yanamic. Yeah. Not sure why. Let's try 0.67 for the blow pump 4K. Dynamic. All right, 16.93 with blanking out the screen again. Let's try the Basotronics Big Wizzy Halloween song. Big Wizzy Bass of Halloween. Here we go. <laughs> 